guys so oh my hair is a mess i apologize for doing this video so late um i didn't get home until a little bit ago um i was out shopping <laughs> all morning um and then i had to take the dogs out when i got home and feed the cats and whatnot and charge my phone because i killed my battery so um Hopefully I have enough battery life to do this video, but let's get into it. Today's Tuesday and that means it's Dollar General Penny Shopping Day. If you're not familiar with penny shopping, what it is is usually every Tuesday there's a list that is sent out and usually everything on that list will ring up a penny. Now, some every store is different. Some stores, some things may not penny. Other stores, things may penny a week later, two weeks later, a month later. You never know. There was one store that I went to today that the green dot leggings weren't pennied out. Um, so that's weird. But, you know, like I said, every store is different. So you're going to want to make sure that you have the Dollar General app downloaded and that you're using the scanner and it's set to the store that you're in. Because like I said, every store is different and the scanner is really helpful. It'll show you um, what things are going to ring up at the register if it if it scans a penny on your app that normally means that will it will be a penny at the register if it does if it scans something other than a penny then it's probably not going to penny at the register so don't even bother <laughs> but anyways um there are a few people that i follow the first one being the freebie guy i follow him on instagram and on YouTube, then there's Krista Coupons, Alicia Savings, and Madison's Madness. I follow them on um, YouTube as well. Now, Madison's Madness has not posted in a really long time. I don't know if she's done or if she's just taking a break, but I stay followed to her anyways, just in case she comes back. But you guys don't have to follow her if you don't want to. But I will put all the links to all the channels in the description box down below, just in case you would like to follow them as well. There are a few Facebook groups I'm in too. Um, all I do is just search Dollar General Penny Shopping in the search bar for groups and joined a couple groups. Um, they're really helpful. Um, they have um, visuals and people post about stuff all the time. So um, it's really nice and it's actually really, really helpful. So join some Facebook groups. That's what helped me out a lot. Um, and how I usually find the list each week is I will go to the freebie guys Instagram, click on the link in the bio. It'll take you to his website. There'll be a three line drop down menu in the top left hand corner. Click on that. Scroll down to where it says penny shopping. Click on that. Um, scroll down. There'll be a couple informational videos. You're going to want to watch those if you're new because that will teach you everything you need to know. And then if you scroll down a little bit farther, you'll see the penny lists for each week. All right. So today's penny list. So it looks short. But each one of those sections at the bottom, those seasonal sections, um, they're all a whole bunch of stuff. I, I have a whole lot of stuff. I have a whole lot of stuff. Um, I kind of hit the mother load today. Um, I went to all three stores, found stuff at all three stores. So let's start with the first store. That's not the first store. This is the first store. So this first store, I found the least stuff, but I still found, I think, six things on this. So the first thing is this home sweet home sign. This is from the lawn and garden. Really cute. It's a little birdhouse thing. So we'll definitely probably use that as decoration for next year. Then this is from the summer toys and pool stuff. Now the chalk and the bubbles are excluded. So if you see the pink square um, and it's on bubbles and chalk, they are still full price. Um, I don't know if they are going to penny or if they're just gonna penny later. I don't know what, but this is from the pool stuff. Um, it's one of those water blaster things. And then I got a smaller Paw Patrol one. Now this does not have a dot on it, but it is, pool toys so it did penny out then i also got this patriotic pennied um the clothes from patriotic did not penny um they're still full price and 
there are a couple of items that are still full price as well but this um is just a couple of necklaces four necklaces that say usa on them and they're red and blue this is originally a dollar this is originally a dollar and i believe that this is originally a dollar so and same with this home sweet home sign and then this is originally a dollar and it's like sand toys part of the pool stuff um it's the bucket and the shovel so that pennied as well so that is all that i got from the first store the second store i got quite a bit of stuff um so I got, I don't want to pull them all out because they are spiky on one end, but I believe there's five in here. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I got five of these. These are grill brushes. Um, I don't use wired brushes because they are actually really bad to use. So I'll probably donate these. Um, but these are originally $2. This is from the garden, lawn and garden section, the barbecue stuff. Um, so it's got a scraper, it's got this um, rough scrubby pad, and then the wire brush, which don't use wire brushes on your grill because it can get in your food and you can get really, really sick. But that's just me. All right. Um, then this I will keep. This is really nice. This is a grill brush or a barbecue spatula. This is originally $3.50. And it's got a sharp edge right here and then a like knife saw kind of edge like right here. It's nice. Then I got a bag of Bear Spot Repair Grass Seed Mixture. This was originally $4. Then I got these patriotic napkins. It says land that I love. These are originally a dollar. Then I got these napkins. These are just the summer, summer napkins. They're pink dot. Originally a dollar. Then I got another one of those patriotic napkins. Then I got um, these match these. These are some straws for a dollar. They're originally a dollar fifty. This is pink dot as well, or purple dot. Purple dot. Sorry, not pink dot. Purple dot. Um, and then I got one, two, three, four, five bags of these seeds and they are microgreens seeds in as little as 10 days to harvest. I don't use microgreens, but there's probably people that will originally a dollar. Then I got some landscape pins. Maybe my husband can use these. These are originally a dollar. They were marked down to 50 cents and then pennied out. Um, then I got some hummingbird nectar. I believe we have a hummingbird feeder, so this will be nice. These are um, originally $2.50. There's one more bag from this store. I got another bag of that grass repair bare spot seed then i got four boxes of these asat alisum carpet of snow seed mixture i guess these are like wildflowers these are originally a dollar fifty so there's four of those then i got this um beach ball it's pink square originally four dollars um, it's Disney princesses. I think it's just Snow White, but I'm not sure. Oh no, it's all Disney princesses. Then I got this little pool bath toy kind of thing. Um, wind up sea animal. It doesn't say the orig original price of this, but I believe it was probably a dollar. Then... I got one more bag of that grass repair mixture. And then I got a pair of little cute shoes, which um, maybe I'll donate. Maybe I'll sell them because they're originally $10. These are really nice. Um, they're yellow dot. 
and this pennied last week, but I didn't go to this store last week. So I was happy I found those. These are size eight toddlers. Neither of my kids can fit them, so they're going to somebody else. Then at the last store, let's start with the cans. So I got a whole bunch of these. These are the Good and Smart tomato condensed soup. My daughter loves tomato soup and I can use these for cooking as like a soup base if I make a soup over the winter. So these are really nice. Um, and they are still in date. It says used by 2-14-2024. So I got, I got 15 cans of those. And then I found the chicken broth by Clover Valley. Some of these are dented, but I mean, that's okay. And these are best used by 12 4 2022. So it says best use. You can use, I believe, like canned goods, you can use them up to like six months to a year after their sell, their um, best buy date. Um, but I'm going to see if I can use these up quick. Um, it's winter, it's going into winter. So, um, Definitely going to be using these for soups and stuff like that, especially chicken noodle. Um, and I don't know if they're all. No, see, this is by 11, 2023. So they're all different dates on these. So um, a lot of these don't expire until the end of 2023. So that's nice. I'll just use up the ones that are going to go bad first. But I got a bunch of these too. And these are the Clover, these are Clover Valley brand, by the way. And I got 13 cans of those. Then I got two of these kites. And I don't know the original price of either of those food items, by the way, but these are originally $2.50. I got a Minnie Mouse kite and it's pink, pink square. And then I got an Avengers kite. So my kids will be excited about those. They love flying kites, especially at a lot of the campsites that we go to. So I will save these for um, next camping season. Then I got these little glasses. This is actually a yellow dot, but this pennied. Um, and they're poppy glasses from Trolls. They're really cute. These are originally $5. Then I got this little bucket thing. This is from Lawn and Garden. This is originally $3 and it says flowers and plant, flowers and planters, I guess, flowers and plants maybe in, I think French. I'm not sure though. I can't pronounce that to save my life. So I'm not even going to try. And that I get, I think I said was originally $3.50. Then I got two of these which we'll definitely be using these next year these are citronella candles it's lemongrass citronella can candle oh my god i can't read infused with essential oils and these are originally 350. there's two of them let's smell them i'm gonna smell that oh my gosh they smell really good so i'm excited to use those i'm definitely going to keep them and then I was just randomly scanning stuff um, down the like home goods aisle or whatever you call it. And um, I found these and they were a penny. So weird. Um, it's just a $6 tray. I guess you put a plate on it or something or I don't know. It's decorative. So I got um, one, two three, four of the little ones. Whoop. I don't know. I think I might try to sell these. I'm not sure though. And then I got two of the bigger ones and these are $8 originally, or no, $10 originally. The little ones are $8 and the big ones are $10. But yeah, I think that's everything that I got. Oh, okay. I was wondering why I was saying $6. I got two little ones for $6, two medium sized ones for $8, and two big ones for $10. So there's um, three different sizes all together, two of each. 
which is kind of nice. And that is everything that I found. Oh my gosh. Big haul this time. Really, really nice. Um, yeah, I'm excited about the tomato soup and the soup broth because those I definitely am going to use for recipes and stuff like that. So those will be really, really nice. Um, the summer stuff my kids will use in the summer and the kites, my kids love kites. So they'll definitely be able to use those and whatever I don't use, I can donate or sell or whatever. But yeah, that is everything for today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Have an awesome day. Bye.